So Stuttering John and Baba Booey go over to... Uh, uh, what's the strip club? It's not a strip club. It's Webster Hall. It's a, oh. it's a, it's a regular mainstream club, and that's part, that was part of the problem. Yeah, they invited a bunch of guys to come down and watch this audition for Spice Girls. Yeah, Spice Girl like Channel. Contest to become a Spice Girl. Yeah, and uh, guys went there to go see girls naked. And the chicks were, some of them were taking their tops off. Uh-huh. Topless was as naked, topless in a G-string was as naked as they could get. And guys watch the Spice Channel, and they see full nudity right. and simulated sex. Right. And I guess they thought they were going to see that on stage, <laughs> so they were very hostile. Right. Yeah. Oh. And, you know, I, I I never understand this. There's a guy in the front row. Right. And he kept yelling out, I, I can't even say it, but he kept saying, show us your, and you get the idea. Right, your vagina. For an hour and a half. Right. And just, never stopped. It, never stopped. Just yelled it over and over again. All right, so this first track we're going to hear is when you and John are out there. And uh, so John, John's job, these, these two idiots go out there, they have nothing to say to the crowd. Well, normally these things are done real smooth. We just right. go and host it and just, you know, bring the girls out. So to give easy. you an idea what happens, so some girl comes up, she speaks some kind of foreign language. And John's got to do the interview portion of the contest. Okay. <laughs> and she don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> she don't know what he, you know, he doesn't know what she's talking about. The, Nobody knows anything. And the crowd's all hostile. Yeah, it's just great. You know, listen. Now, I was told earlier, John, you have to talk really slow to our next contestant and enunciate and don't stutter because Margot is from Paris and she speaks very limited English. Now, these guys are pissed off to begin with because they haven't seen any breasts. And they don't care about talking. This one didn't even take her clothes off, right? Well, we, what happened was, first of all, we asked the questions before the girls even get naked. So, right. we asked, so th already the guys are bored. Right. Then later on... Hey, they don't want to hear questions. They're mad at her now. This up. Later yeah. on, she comes out and she dances and she doesn't take her top off. They were like Ooh. throwing stuff at the stage. What did she wear? Like a bathing suit? She was wearing these uh, black vinyl hot pants, <laughs> these big like giant shoes, and just like a bikini top. And she didn't dance. Uh, and she danced <laughs> in a funny way. Yeah, she, really? like a she stood in one spot and just moved around a lot. <laughs> I, I, I take that to mean she didn't win the contest. Oh. Oh. <laughs> but limited, so just be gentle with Margot. Be gentle, Margot. How are you? Fine, very fine. But imagine, like, you go to a contest, you this French chick, and you see John being the interviewer, like big mountain man. With He's standing there like this. Yeah. Grizzly big Adam. Grizzly Adams is interviewing you. You know, you know you're at the bottom of show business. Yeah. <laughs> and, and in all fairness, I have to say, the reason why I threw out my chocolate yesterday, yeah. I watched the videotape from this night. Yeah. Ooh, was I'm just like a big fat guy on Yeah, you're stage. fat. Huge. When was the best time you ever faked an orgasm? And can we see a little of what you think was your award-winning performance? He's talking to her like she's deaf. You know how people talk to farm people? <laughs> and slow. What was your best orgasm? And can we see a little bit of your award-winning performance? I said to myself, you know, because you go to a foreign country, you find yourself yelling at everybody. Like, if you talk louder, they're going to understand a language they don't understand. Well, when I do the Kama Sutra, it was very good. <laughs> You better talk slow. <laughs> when I do the position with the Kama Sutra, was very good. Well, I think I think they want you to they fake. No. Can you fake an orgasm for everybody? Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> oh la la. <laughs> Later I do it. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up and spread them. Oh, this reminds me of those uh, the Romans when they used to get the Christians. So in you can the imagine, lions. you can imagine what was going on there. Then and then, uh, this is kind of funny too. So Stuttering John and Gary uh, are sent out to sort of kill time <laughs> because the girls aren't ready to do their dancing they gotta yet. Gotta buy some time for the girls. Yeah, one, one girl already danced naked, and the guys weren't in love with her, so they're right. pissed off. Yeah. Now John and I have to go out there and talk to the crowd while the next girl gets ready. These guys, all they want is naked women. John must say "How you doing?" at least fifty <laughs> times. How you Because these two guys have nothing to say to the crowd. They didn't bring any lines at all. Well, usually yeah. it just goes smooth. You yeah. don't do anything. I don't know. Check this out. We got a couple of minutes till the girls are ready. <laughs> How you doing? So, what's going on? <laughs> so far, who do we like? Not you. Huh? These guys <laughs> insist on asking the crowd questions, and you, you can see you can't hear it. It's like. <laughs> 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 they ask questions it's like this was get a response <laughs> you know what's the worst that's Howard? What, I know he's there and I'm going this is this is horrible <laughs> that's what John does he asks questions <laughs> all right everybody hold up a mirror and entertain yourself because we're not gonna do it <laughs> is breast size important or no do you think any of those breasts are real do we like that <laughs> The girl in the back, I said, are those real? And she said, yeah, real expensive. 
Oh, man. Oh, man. Wait, hold on. I'm going to be doing my Clinton jokes doing? any minute. Right, right. Shades of Melrose, Larry Green. I know. Wait, wait, wait. How you doing? The crowd's there to see naked women. Yeah. <laughs> they don't want to see us. So a lot of us, uh, so now we got to stall for a little bit, so just bear with us. You guys drinking out there or no? How do you answer that if you're in the crowd? They're all confused. They're like, ah, oh, uh, see, uh, I heard they cut the drinks from the from, from the crowd because it was No, but possible. I mean, listen to your question. Are you guys drinking out there? Or not? Or I no. Should've, I should have yeah, said or no. Or <laughs> <laughs> <I was, laughs> no. No, yeah, no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, if the bartender's listening, I could use myself a beer right now. I could use myself a beer. <laughs> I, 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 I He's right. <laughs> you really could. You could use two. That's the first smart thing you said on stage. <laughs> I could use myself a beer. There's one mic too, Alex. So me and Gary. Do I want a beer or do I not want a beer? <laughs> they send us out there and, and all the mics aren't working except for one, so John and I have to hand it back. John has to work for two minutes and talk to the crowd. He needs a beer. <laughs> <laughs> John checked his brain at the door. Oh, I really did. Uh, Gary starts asking the crowd for jokes. This is even funnier. <laughs> like, you know how the two entertainers are supposed to have some jokes? Baba Booey. Baba you want them to get jokes. And they're saying, is anybody out there more entertaining? Please <laughs> There's got to be. <laughs> Gary, would you like one? <clears throat> A beer? So how's it going, eh? <laughs> how's it going? Everyone from New York? How's it going? Everyone from New York. Uh, tell us where you're all from. Yeah. <laughs> Individually. <laughs> hey, everyone from New York? And they don't even wait for answers. Everyone it's like from New York? Where about? Bronx? Long Island? Brooklyn? Upstate. Everyone listen to the show? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're just going to hang out here for a little bit. Second time he's already First told him. First of all, you're in New York. I mean, yeah. people didn't rush there from California. No, Who Jersey. even knows about that? Could have had Jersey. Second of all, could have had Jersey. They were, <laughs> makes a difference. <laughs> the show was promoted on the air, so most of them are listeners. Most people you from... You know the answers to all these questions. Mo mo most people from New York. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just this guy gave Man. me the mic. Yeah, what would you do if somebody was from Alaska? You know, it's <laughs> funny. These two guys are passing off the mic like it's a hot potato. Oh, I, I know. They're uh, shutting yeah, I don't want other. it. You take it. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what's going on? You guys should just pass the mic back and forth. What, what's going on is they said it'll be about a minute. So John and I keep looking to the back, and they keep giving us a signal it's to a stretch. Long right. I think it was. Hey, hey, how many of you are here tonight? <laughs> <laughs> They'd have been better off letting us go to the side of the stage and just playing the music. Notice the music is blasting, too, while they're yeah, talking. The and we don't have any monitors, so we can't yeah, hear ourselves, great. so we're it's yelling. Great. It's a great gig. Great. <laughs> Gary, know any good jokes for the crowd? So now it's my potato. <laughs> Does anybody know any good uh, Bill Clinton jokes? <laughs> John goes, Gary, you know any jokes? And Gary goes, hey, anybody here know any jokes? <laughs> it's a great gig. <laughs> anybody know any jokes? Any oh, Bill Clinton no. jokes? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so how you doing? <laughs> you guys drinking out there or no? I think been. I need a beer. It's a great. It's so great. I, I could use a beer. You guys are the best. <laughs> you want a beer? I mean, laugh my head. <laughs> These poor guys want to see some naked breasts. You guys from New York? And some vag. <laughs> Anybody here from New York? Well, 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 they could have been from Jersey. <laughs> Uh, uh, can I, uh, uh, you listen to the show? Uh, who, who listens to the show? <laughs> Anybody got any Bill Clinton jokes? <laughs> I tell you what, we're going to drink on stage while you guys tell each other some jokes. Does anybody know a four-letter word for cat? <laughs> <laughs> What's your those? shoe size? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody here know their shoe size? Yell it out. <laughs> Let's how see many, if we have. <laughs> how many of you drove? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, or not. You, uh, you, uh, use mass, ma ma mass, ma <laughs> mass transit. Mass <laughs> transit. <laughs> 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 oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh. oh, oh, Jason, go ahead. You're on the air. Hey, it's pretty funny. I was watching uh, <sighs> thing of Webster Hall. Gary, hello? 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah Gary was eating like five pieces of chocolate cake. <laughs> is, is that true, Gary? Oh. So true. Really? Not I mean, on stage, though. Not on people, stage. People are coming over trying to shake Gary's hand. Hey, Gary, how you doing? And he's wiping like pieces, you know, pieces of chocolate. He's like, hey, excuse me, I'm trying to eat cake. <laughs> hey, that was my time to eat. We my both had to on, hit the bottle. Mine was the beer, and Gary was the cake. My, time on, my time on stage is my time on stage. Any Bill Clinton jokes that you've heard? <laughs> Wait, What's the new game Gary in Washington? Just asked that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gary, give it back to me. <laughs> Gary gives him back the mic. He goes, anybody got any Clinton jokes? And then he gives his mic back to John. Yeah. Pin, swallow the leader. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Gary's, Gary's on the yeah. wall. Uh-oh. Yeah. Tell, him my, hey, no. tell him my jokes, yeah. man. <laughs> Baba go. Booey. See, Gary's got jokes. Yeah. yeah, any Bill Clinton jokes that you've heard? What's the new game in Washington? Swallow the leader. Hey. You like that one? <laughs> that's so bad. Hey, that's the first material that was done in two minutes. I know. What do you mean? This was material? an attempt. <laughs> I like the bad porno music going on in the back. Yeah. Uh, what does uh, Bill Clinton say to Hillary after he has sex? Be home in 20 minutes? <laughs> Come on. Did he tell that right? I'll be home in 20 minutes. Yeah, be home in 20 minutes. <laughs> no, you told it wrong. Be home in 20 minutes. Could have been no, no. Trump. I meant I was. You got to say I'll be home in 20. Doing minutes. it in first person. Be home. I'll be home in 20. Oh, you're Clinton. Yes, yes. Oh. I was. That was. A yeah, what? Well, I'm president <laughs> of the United States. Is what I tell my wife. Be home in 20 minutes. You told it all wrong. How you you should. You two should have just stripped. How you doing? You should come back to how you doing. <laughs> how you doing? Don't worry. We go, how John how goes back to it again. He does. Of course. Yeah. Well, let's see. Let's see how long before John goes back to how you doing. <laughs> let's bet. Is she ready? What the fuck could she possibly be doing? Hey, did any of you guys hear the show this morning? Did you hear the two girls from the Spice Channel that were on the show this morning? I wish, first, first of all, Kylie is very cute, but she has totally corrupted the receptionist from Spice. What's he talking <laughs> about? <laughs> Who are you not talking about? Just not even a clue. <laughs> I'm talking about the two girls that were on the air this morning. But it's such a complicated... Yeah, trying, yeah you're mean, right. You, if they were there, it might be... Well, they thing. were. This is a girl. They were. Well, why would you bring them up and introduce them to the Please. Crowd? We do. Later yeah. on. God. He's dying. Uh, we're dying. Like, these were the girls who were on the show this morning. Why didn't you read the menu at the place? <laughs> are they got a food they're serving or anything? <laughs> and they're like a couple now. Wait, you see, when you see them on the East Shore, you're not going to believe it. They kiss and they... Wore, you hear them wearing the... Uh, the vibrating and the tickling panties. He's he's doing a drive. You know, but Robin's right. E we'd have been we'd have been better just saying, you know, Bud Bud Light, you know, right. Amstel Amstel right. Light. What an embarrassing gig. Very erotic. Gig. Very erotic. John, you're up. <laughs> I think they planned this to make us look like idiots. And it's working. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> how you doing? Okay. And Howard, I got to tell you something. Uh, just to make it better there. for the air, in all fairness, I cut about two minutes out of that. <laughs> <laughs> you should have left it all. Really? This uh, is great. What'd you cut out? Any questions you'd like to ask us while we're sitting here? <laughs> 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 He's going to ask questions. Goddamn crowd could care less. <laughs> we're the girls. Must have seemed like a week you were up uh, there. Oh, yeah. God. Right. So things go so bad <laughs> that, you know, the girls are getting booed because they're not taking off all their clothes <laughs> and everything. So this girl comes out to address the crowd. To give the girl some respect, but she comes up to me and she says she's one of the strippers. Okay, she, she's uh, the porn star. That girl, right? Uh, okay, whatever. She comes up to me and she says, uh, "Gary, very nicely, Gary. Do you think I could address the crowd for a minute?" So I'm like, "Yeah, finally somebody else." <laughs> right. And all right. So here it is. Here's so she's going to say lecture them. Yeah. Oh. This is all during the same break, right? Uh, it's like a break later. Okay. Here we go. Kylie has something to say. <laughs> hey, you guys. Do you love your naked women? These beautiful ladies. Because you Because you're not seeing pussy. Oh jeez, what a speech. Talk to Rudy Giuliani. It's his fucking law, not ours. That's it. Yeah. Now she's mad at Rudolph Giuliani because she can't show her chooch. Political Kylie. Yeah, a political girl. This is all political. That's right. Next time you vote, remember. This is like the scene. This is like the scene in Fist where he gets really mad. And One fist. 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 The three stooges. Yeah. This is where a stripper becomes political. She's like the retarded Jane Fonda. <laughs> this is amazing. It's an amazing night, isn't it? Isn't this great? I'm bringing How did you. We miss this? I'm bringing you all the drama. Write him a goddamn letter. We're doing what we can to turn you guys on. Does anybody have a heart on? Have you seen my movies? Have you seen Jill Kelly's movies? That'll give you a heart on it. So when these damn girls give them the decency to clap for them because they're fucking sexy, naked or 
not. Let me hear you. She has to yell at guys to dig chicks. You know it must be pretty bad. Wow. Oh. You know. If you have to yell at the guys to... Talk them into it. Yeah, man, how many guys you know aren't happy to see chicks? <laughs> And then, and just just to know the the postscript of the whole night to yeah. add insult to injury. Yeah. When we finally got down to the finalists, yeah, there was total confusion. And the, there was a girl <laughs> that worked for Spice. We picked the wrong person. Right. The guy, the audience started booing. The guy that runs Spice came out, grabbed the microphone, started yelling, "We're a stand-up channel. We're paying both girls." Cut the music. There was a mistake. And Spice is a stand-up company. Both girls that were. Top of the uh, applause meter. We'll both win five thousand dollars and share the crown. Oh man! Oh, this, Jesus! Wow. This is a disaster. It is a goddamn disaster. I can't believe how bad it is. <laughs> hey, Baba Booey, I'm backstage at the the Big Spice Girls contest. Not the Spice Girls like the ones from England. This is for the Spice Network, and uh, there's eleven girls competing from all over the world. I guess they're competing to be Miss Spice Network, and. Uh, as, a, as a, the girl said in the air this morning, whoever wins, the doors will be open to the porn industry for her. Are you guys ready to meet the girls? On your applause, I'm gonna give you like 10 seconds. We're gonna go through it once. John, you help me judge. Let's hear it for Juliet. A little weak, a little weak. Okay, let's hear it for Jessica. And quiet, quiet. Let's hear it for Mina. We are glad that you are in agreement with us. Grand Prize Award to announce the winner of the search for the Spice Girl. The winner receives $5,000 and will have the opportunity to represent Spice on air as well at trade shows and conventions. Conventions and the winner is Crazy night. It ended in controversy. I still don't know what happened. I picked a winner. She picked a winner. Somebody else won. I gotta go home. <laughs>